that's where the idea of the school came about. Right. You know? Okay. So, because it goes back to right now, because we, you know, we were kind of hesitant at first. And it was D Styles that actually says, you know, we should open up a school. I'm like, yeah, I don't know, man. But D, when D said it out, so I'm like, look, look what happened to old world champion, champion boxers when they retired. They opened a gym, right? And they teach, oh, that's so sick. Okay. Right? Not saying that we retired. I get you. But, you know, but that's, you know, because we were thinking, we're in a, we're, when we did, when we had our 20 year anniversary, like who thought we had a 20 year anniversary and shit like that? Yeah. We didn't know, we were still a crew, you know, but we were, you know, but everybody was busy like that. But it's like, J Rock was a, was a, was against of having an a, a anniversary because he's, 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 he says, I don't want to date myself. Yeah, but, you I know, get it. I get it. You know, I, I, I get it too. But, but it's like, you know, too. It's a big, it's a big thing. It's 20, man. It's, it's a big, it's a biggie. It's a big thing. So when we did it, we were surprised when we started doing shows and doing tours of it, we were surprised how many people came out, especially in LA, like how many, like, like how many people wanted to see us perform still and the age difference. Like That's cold. Really, that kind of yeah. blow, blow in our minds. And it got to a point where it's almost like kind of like a second wind. And we kind of realized that we're older now, we're mm-hmm. mature, you know, we're, you know, because 10, when we had our 10 year anniversary, you know, we had a label and all that stuff, but we weren't, we were still artists. We were still, you know, we were just trying to get shit, you know, we didn't, mm-hmm. we weren't, we weren't, we weren't uh, uh, mature enough. Yeah. Now we're mature enough. That made me realize, you know what, that made us realize like, let's, let's, we see, we still got something. We be uh, fools if we don't, you know, yeah, uh, take advantage of this. So we started, you know, we started putting back merch, and we eventually started our, our, our website pool, and then because your brand was always tight as well. That's the other thing, right? But then you know, but this is this is us now doing the work and really to match it, like you know, match it, yeah. And then when D says like you know the next step, we're like, what, 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 what can we do? Because we already got the pool, we got this, we got that. It's so opened up a school, and from there. It may, you know, we started realizing, like, you know what? Instead of complaining about what's going on with what's going on right now in the, in the DJ scene, let's do something about it. That's right. At least put and and then it goes back again to also culture wise. Mm-hmm. Why is it hip hop is the only cultural genre is that we we don't teach our history and we we debunked our legends and we make we make fun of, our, uh, of the young kids while you see other music genres or cultures going crazy. Yeah. Doing always giving up to their, their you know, knowing the history, giving up to their heroes, the legends mm. showing and showing culture. So mm. once we got again, ego, take the ego out. Yeah. Once we got over that, that's when things just opened up a lot of things. And, you know, that, that was another, you know, uh, I was a, again. I was trained, you know. I was trained jitsu already, and that was how I would apply it. Because now it makes you say, "Okay, sure, I'm a teacher, but teaching is a whole another whole ball game, man." Yeah. It really it makes you realize. It makes you become a student again, and That's honestly, cold. because of, because of being a teacher, I become. I actually became a better DJ because I'm able to teach. Because I'm able to break it down. Like mm. out of all of us, Mr. Chalk was the one that has been teaching. He was teaching at the Scratch Academy in LA. Right. He was like the, the, the LA director and stuff. And so we told him we want to open school. And he's like, you know, like, you want to make money for them or you want to make money for the crew, for yourself? Yeah. yeah. And so that, and he taught, he was the one that kind of helped us to learn how to teach. We thought teaching was going to be easy. Oh, hell no. Yeah, no, no, there's a whole. <laughs> oh, hell no. But I tell you so, what, though, it does keep you grounded. I mean, like, your ear is on the ground the whole time. When you're listening to, I found when I was teaching, not by any means close to the way you guys are, but I, you know, I had my, I had my turn, I had my season of it, and um, yeah, they do throw some questions, an honest question, that makes you realise, yo, actually, they got a point, you know, and yeah, actually, this, you feel like you're closer to the to to a younger a younger um, generation, don't you? It's well, not even that. It's just. With our school, oh, it's different youngest, ages. It, our our youngest is like 
nine, 10 years old. Our oh, oldest wow. is like 52, 53 years old. Uh, the oldest, our oldest student is a judge. Get out. Woo. I'm not kidding. That's crazy. Six, like 60, 70% of our students are women. That's amazing. Of course. Yeah. No, and it's crazy. Women pick up DJing quicker than guys. Yeah, I'm all about that. I'm all you about know? celebrating that. Yeah. So, and it's and it's crazy because it's like I, we we were able to give them a space because you know women are intimidated. It's a DJing, you know, testosterone driven DJing. man fest. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, <laughs> so, yeah. so uh, once once we were able to give them that space, man, they took off. Man, they're like, man, we got some great students. It happened to be women that just yeah. was killing it and shit. That's inspiring. Inspi- inspiring and shit. It's like, oh shit, I better go practice and shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Man, now, but yeah, you. man, I mean, uh, it, it, it learned, it, hum- it goes back in, it humbles you, makes you realize, man, you know, like, it's, if we want something, you know, if you want it right or what, or, you know, you, you don't want to, comp- you know, don't complain, do something about it. <laughs>